Hi everyone, I'm back with another Timu try-on. And um, I didn't say hi, my name is Diane from Mimi's Life. But um, long time no see, it seems like forever that I've gotten to make a video. So, I'm telling y'all what, I've got so much stuff coming in because I have gone crazy ordering stuff for my vacation. <laughs> I've ordered bathing suits, uh, you name it, and I've ordered it. So, y'all be seeing all of my stuff um, getting ready for vacation in June. So, I'm going to show you what I have today. I pulled up my computer um, to try to see if I could give you the prices. But it's a bunch of different little orders. So, I'm going to try to see if I can give you some of the prices. But, you know, not guaranteed that I'll tell you all the prices. But you are used to that with me, aren't you? So, I'll get right into this. Um, because I've got to be out of here. Guess what tomorrow is? Guess what tomorrow is? Thursday. And guess what I do on Thursday? I get a new smile. I am so excited. Like, who gets excited to go to the dentist? I do. Because I can't stand looking like this anymore. Um, my sister-in-law, I call her my sister-in-law because she has, she's still my sister-in-law. I'm not married to her brother anymore. But I have known her since I was 15 years old. That's how old I was when I started going with my son's um, father. I, uh, I'll just tell you a short story. I started going with him when I was 15. He was 16. Well, we went together for four years, right? 15, 16, 17, 18. We was together for three years. Three years, and we got married when I was 18. And he was 19. So, I married him in, um, no, I met him in 1980. We married in 1984. We had our first child in 1988 which was Alex Paul, my son that passed away. Um, and then 10 years later, we had our other son, Samuel James, which is my baby. And then we divorced. Samuel was born in 1997. And we divorced in 1999 1999 I think I think something like that Samuel wasn't very old but anyway <clears throat> yeah it just we were together for a long long time and we grew up as kids together and so his family you know, they know me since I was just a young kid. So, um, I still love them with all my heart. So, I still uh, call Barbara my mother-in-law. And Sue is still my sister-in-law. So, to make a long story short, she came over here yesterday to see me and the kids. She just lives right a couple of streets over. So she came by to see us. And, um, you know, I was up in her face talking to her. She was, oh, what happened to your teeth? And I was like, oh my gosh, I don't even want to show you because she has a denture. And she only has a few teeth left in the bottom. She needs a bottom denture. But me and her was talking about how hard it is for a the bottom denture to fit you because you don't have any suction down there like you do on the um, roof of your mouth so I know I need a bottom one too but I'm scared that I'm not going to be able to wear it because she said that 
she's scared to get one because she's just heard bad things. Because her sister, um, Kathy, she's got upper and lowers, but she don't wear her lowers because they don't stay in. And I know my brother, he had upper and lowers, and he had a hard time keeping his bottom ones in. He had to glue them. So, I was scared about that. But, you know, my mom had dentures, and they put them in because tomorrow they're going to do all the, all the work on my mouth. And then they're going to put the healing denture right in. So that's what they did to my mom. And they put her bottoms in too. And she never had one problem with them. She, They just fit right in her mouth. And she never had to glue them or nothing. So she was lucky. But <clears throat> anyway, let me get on with this haul. Because I'm just talking, talking. You need me, babe? I want a new piercing. Okay. Um, first off, I'm going to show you this shirt that I got. It's real pretty. It's long. I can actually wear, like, this has got navy in it. It looks black. I had to really put it under the light to figure out what color it was. Let me put my camera down a little bit. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I have everything... Well, what is this doing? I have everything rigged up because my ring light went out. I'm going to have to go to Walmart today and buy me a new ring light. I wanted to order one maybe on Timu, like one of those square ones because mine are round. And the ring lights always, if they're not square, they get in your eyes. Guys, I'm trying to fix this thing as I'm talking. Shoot. Yeah, it doesn't want to stay up there. But it's kind of dark. It's been raining here for two days. There it goes. I can't touch it. But, um, yeah, it's been raining here for two days. So I have this little um, ring light that, like you said, on tables and stuff. So I have that one kind of sitting over there real gently uh, on top of the other ring light. So it's a shaky business back there. But, anyway, and I didn't get to use my table today because this little ring light, it won't, it won't, um, stretch from the plug that I have it on. And I don't want to go look for an extension cord and all that mess. So, I just said the heck with it. I'm just going to do it like this today. But, I've got, I've got another order over there that I need to, more stuff that I need to try on and all that. And, um. I don't have it ready to to go today, so I'm not even going to do that. I'll do that tomorrow. And I've got a couple of reviews that I need to get out. So, anyway, that was this shirt. And then, here's another one that I got. It's just a, it's just a white and blue check, but it's, it's almost like seersucker material. Am I saying that right? It feels like I'm not saying that right. But the arms on it, it's like this. I thought it's really cute. And put a really cute long necklace on with it. I think that would be adorable. So, I got these two shirts right here that I just laid on the bed. Because, um, you need me, babe? Uh, because I, I'm going to tell you the price of them. I got everything that was in that order pulled up, and I'm going to show you what was in this order and try to do it like that, so maybe I can tell you the prices. Um, that blue and white check shirt was $7.99. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Yeah. Oh, heck. Okay, I just don't know how to use this computer. No. And the other one, the mustard color one with that I said the leggings could go under, is nine ninety eight. So, let me show you these things that go to this order. Oh darn it! My ring light fell off again. Hold on, guys. Okay. 
I hope I don't have that problem through the whole video. Maybe I need to go get some tape and tape it down. Today, this shirt that I have on came from another company that I, um, you've already seen me haul it. And it, this is from them. And let's see, do I have on Timu earrings? Yes, these are Timu earrings. And this necklace here is a Timu necklace. And then I have on this beautiful bracelet. Um, it's called Champagne, I think. But this is the Timu bracelet that I have on today. So, that's what I have on. And then I have on blue jeans. And right now I've got on house shoes. Alright, so... I got Abigail this outfit. It's so adorable. This is the little shirt. And it's cotton. It's 100% cotton. And then here is the little shorts with pockets. They got little pockets in them. So this is the outfit. Isn't that cute? Put her some real cute little bows in her hair and put some piggy tails or some moon buns cute she look adorable in that and that was four dollars and seventy nine cents that is a great price you go back up to the top okay I got a curling iron. I haven't hooked it up to see how hot it'll get or whatever. Because our curling iron went out and Tara, um, the youngest of the three of my oldest son's girls, I curl her hair in the mornings before she goes to school. And our curling iron went out. She likes, she likes this size right here. I was trying to read if it, what? A uh, voltage it has. 240. 110 to 240. So I guess that's what it is. That's not very hot, is it? 240. Yeah, I guess so. There goes my ring light again. I'll fix it in a minute. I don't know if y'all can see me okay. I don't want the room to look too dark. Y'all are probably going to tell me it's just fine without it. But anyway, it, this is the on and off buttons there. It's pretty cool. You just push that up. We'll see. I'll let y'all know if it gets hot enough to curl her hair. Her hair is real thick. And it's real long all the way down to her waist. So, she's got beautiful hair. That curling iron was $7.97. No, $7.07. So, that was a pretty good price. Okay. So, I got a pair of blue jean shorts. This is what they look like. They're long cutoffs. And, um... I ordered an extra large in them because I've gained so much dang No, it's a double X. It's a XXL and they're too big. But my granddaughter um, loves big baggy clothes so she's like, Mimi, I love those shorts and she'll wear a big belt with them and a real cute stylish shirt. So You remember you tried these shorts on? Yeah. It's my grandbaby Sadie. So I told him that you like these kind. They look real cute on her. <clears throat> I wish you would say hi, but she won't. <laughs> I, I know. She's so pretty. She's so beautiful. Okay. You um, look like a hog right now. You do not. She's doing her makeup because she's going to go with me. Oh. 
I started tanning. Um, I used to tan all the time. I'd go to the tanning bed and tan all the time. I was always so dark and brown and but you know I was a lot younger and I could wear shorter shorts and I was comfortable in a bathing suit it so it was a much different and you know after I got older I just stopped going and I was I need a drink guys that was the patches that I wear for for helping me to stop smoking they make my mouth so dry but um anyway I'll tell you a short little story Whenever I met my husband eight years ago, I was, our, my wedding dress was a size six. So, I was pretty lean and, and, um, had these nice legs. I, you know, I don't know what happens to us. We get some age on us and everything goes to hell in a handbasket just it's just so depressing but you know what I thank God that I'm still here so I shouldn't complain I'm not complaining because I've had a good life but anyway yeah so whenever we met nine years ago I looked pretty good and um, I tend all the time well, my husband didn't care if I tanned or not. He don't care if I'm fat or skinny. So, I just stopped tanning. It's just, you know, some people say, oh, don't do that. It's bad for you or whatever. But it's really not that bad. Matter of fact, my niece, um, she has psoriasis really bad on her legs. And her doctor told her to start tanning. That it... It'll really help a whole lot. And it has. It's helped a whole lot. Because she hates it. Because it's all over her legs. So, anyway. I'm tanning. Before my vacation. And then right before my vacation. The girl said I could cancel it at any time. And it's costed me. Um, 40, $41 a month. It's cost me $41 a month. And I'll only tan for two months. And then I won't tan no more. I just want to look good whenever. So I came home and I told my husband. I started tanning today. He goes, why? And I said, because. I want. I don't want to look like a, a big fat white whale on the beach. It's bad enough that I'm fat. You know, I don't want to look like a. a it completely draw attention to myself. I'm white <laughs> she said, I'm whiter than you. She is. Even she's half Mexican. She's half Mexican, but she does not look like she has a bit of Mexican in her. She is white as a ghost, and she burns so bad. So, anyway, she doesn't care, though. She likes to be white, white. So, he's like, why? And I said, because, you know, I don't want to look like a big, fat, white whale on the beach. And... He goes, oh, that's silly. Who cares? And I said, I do. You know, I'm a woman. I care. So, I was watching um, Aaron, and she got her eyelashes done. And uh, I couldn't tell that she had them done for a minute until she, uh, you know, said that she had them done. And then I started looking. I'm like, oh, she looks so pretty. I she does. She looks so pretty. But, um, I almost fell out of the chair when she said how much she paid. Three, almost $300, she said. I was like, holy moly. What shop did she go to? Because my shop that I go to, she charges like uh, 100 to 150 the very first time. I paid a hundred the very first time, and then uh, when I go in like every two weeks, it's forty dollars. So you figure it's eighty dollars a month, but I think she's paying a lot for her bills too. 
bless her heart. But she sure does look pretty. She looks pretty. She's got the most beautiful skin. So anyway, let me get back to my haul and quit talking. Um, I got some knives. Got this little knife here. Let me see how much it was. I can't see nothing. This was $2.24. And I had hauled a couple more of these. They are sharp. And they are good knives. It's just a little... I don't know. What is it? It's a little bit bigger than a paring knife, maybe. Or is it a paring knife? Little Cook is what the name of these are. And I got a, a knife sharpener off of Timu. It's a great knife sharpener. I know I hauled it a while back. But I should have brought it in here so I could show y'all. But it's a really good knife sharpener. So I got this little knife here. And then I got this big knife which it goes in this little case so I needed new knives all my knives are so dull they wouldn't cut they don't cut butter so I got those two how much was the big knife this big knife was six dollars and 48 cents and then let's see what else did I get what's in there oh just a piece of paper let me throw that away. I got a trash sack right here. And then let's see. I, I got this package here. And it came two knives in it. And these two knives were $4.49. And this is what these look like. I like these little deals. That's what that looks like. They both look like that. I like the little these things because I have a drawer that I put all like my knives and stuff like that in a utensil drawer and I really like these because sometimes when you go in there and you're looking for something you don't want to hit that sharp knife so I need to get me a block is what I need to do that'd be the smart smart way to go about it but I'm not too smart so that's what I have in that little order and I'm just going to go and show y'all what I got instead of trying to look it up if that's okay with y'all. Because it's kind of hard. Because I'd have to look up this other stuff. And I know y'all don't want to just sit and wait for me to pull up stuff on the computer. So I'm not going to mess with it guys. I'm sorry. I'm putting the computer over there. That'll give me more time to talk to y'all. I don't want to look for the prices. Um, if you want anything from my order, just let me know. And I'll get Layla <laughs> to send it to send it to you. So, um, or I'll tell you the price of it. So, I got this little shirt for Abby to wear with just a little pair of white shorts or blue jean shorts or whatever and it's 100% cotton isn't it cute I love these these just little simple little shirts that you just put on and they look she looks so cute in everything so I got that little shirt for her I got her a pair of white tennis shoes I got her two pair of white tennis shoes the other ones are real cute but when she seen them, she wanted to put them on. And then she went in the backyard and got in the sandbox. So, go figure. But, let's see what size did I get her. An 8. But they're just little white tennis shoes that got the Velcro on the top. They're nothing special. They're just simple shoes. And I think they were like $6 or something like that. And next, I got her some bathing suits. And guess what? My son won't let her wear them. I've got to send them back. And they are the cutest thing. They look so cute on her. Here's the little top. This one especially. I loved it so much. 
and here's the little bottoms. How cute is that? He said they're too tight. That he doesn't want. I'm like, Samuel, she's three years old. He goes, Mom, we're going to be on a beach. And there might be tons of people out there. And you don't know who's going to be looking at her. And, you know, I don't want no attention brought to her. I said, Samuel. He is so anal about everything. He won't let her wear two shorts of shorts. and But, he's a protective little daddy. Here is the other one. Now, this one he said was okay. Here is the little top. It's got dinosaurs all over it. Isn't that cute? He said she can keep this one. And here's the little bottoms. And they got a bow on the butt. Isn't that cute? And I'm going to have to send that other one back. And this one. I'm going to have to send this one back. It's just a little. Like mermaid kind of. Top. And these little shorts. Aren't they adorable? He said no. Nope. He said, order her some one pieces. I said, boy, when she gets to be a teenager, uh -oh. he's going to have tight range on her. I'm tell you that. Because he is so protective of that baby. He is so protective of that baby. But that's a good thing, you know. That is a good thing. It's He's a single dad raising that baby by himself. He's doing a great job. With a little help from Mama. So I got these little rings that um, go on your t-shirt or whatever shirt. It's like that. And instead of tying it up in a knot, you know, like you have to do sometimes if the t-shirt's too big. You just put this on there and it, it makes it a lot decorative, more decorative. It makes it a lot prettier than a big knot tied. So I got those for that reason. Because I got a couple of shirts like that. So, don't really know why I ordered this. Because I ordered that really nice glass case and I love it so much. Let me show y'all. I put all my glasses in there. Isn't it nice? I love it. And I, I didn't have enough room for um, all my glasses. Because I've done two um, sponsors for two companies. And I got three pair of glasses from each company so I have six pair of glass prescription glasses plus the ones that I wear all the time these are a little bit hard for me to get used to because they don't have a a line that I'm used to they're just all you know all the same and they they feel like they're too strong or something can't figure it out but they sure are pretty so, I got a glass case, and I don't know why I ordered it, but I can put my sunglasses in this. It was really cheap. I don't know how much it was. It was on like a lightning deal, and so I got this. I'll put my sunglasses. I got some sunglasses coming, so that's what I'll do with that. I know my eyes feel really, really tired, but I slept, went to bed like at 930 and I got up at um, 6.30 this morning. Starting to take the kids to school. Okay, so I didn't buy these. Um, the other grandma bought these for Abby. And I got her hooked up with Timu. And she is hooked up. She spends tons of money on there. But she got her a pair of water shoes. Because she said, we all need water shoes to um, keep our, 
protect our feet from the sea, seashells and stuff. So, they're just little water shoes. And they're so cute. So, she got her those. I thought I'd show those to you because they still came from Timu. But I don't know how much she paid for them or anything. Okay, I got this little thing. This uh, is a French bread. French bread. Not, fr not to cook with. Not French bread. French braid. French braid to braid your hair. I thought that I would try to do Abby's hair with this. Her hair might be too thin and stuff for this. I might try this on Tara if she'll let me. But that's what that's for. And it was real cheap. Just a few cents. I thought, well, I'll get that and try it. I've never learned how to French braid. My sister, boy, she just whip it out. Both of my sisters. But I never did learn it. And I don't know why, because I have all granddaughters. I gotta get a drink, guys. I'm talking too much. Yeah. She said she laughed in there. Don't be laughing. I'm laughing. So, I got Abby some boy shorts. Because, you know, we're trying to potty train. Aren't they cute? Got her this little pair. These. Those. They're so cute. And those. Oh, we're having the hardest time training her. And we don't believe in spanking. You just, you don't spank her because she peepees in her pants. That's not the way to go about things in my book. I mean, we clap and everything whenever she does it, but she's really hard to train. I, I don't think I've... I know I did not have a hard time training my other three. So, she's she's really been a hard one. My, my leg, guys, my bad leg, the one that needs to be replaced. If I sit down too long, it, um, it locks up. You know, I am going to... As bad as I don't want to, because that is the most painful surgery. I'm going to have to do my other leg, because I'm just not going to, I'm not going to have a very good quality of life if I don't get my leg fixed. And that's very important to have, your legs to walk and everything else. I got her a little um, frozen brush for her hair. She loves frozen. Oh, I know what I was going to tell you. I got several shirts that um, has came in. And I have them over there. I look over there because I have them hanging over there. Because they were totally, totally so wrinkled that you wouldn't even been able to tell what the shirt looks like. So I've already washed them and pressed them. So they're hanging over there. Instead of me just picking them up like I did these two, picking them up and showing you, I'll just show you the same time that I try them on. So I thought that would be easier than show you and then have to try them on and then show you again. So I'll show you when I try them on. You need me? So, where's my little cutter? Let me see if I have anything else that's big that I need to show you. No. All the rest is jewelry. Remember my last, um, my last haul? I, I had to cut out of it because Abby woke up and I had to go help my son. Which one? Those. Please. Yeah. So, this is the jewelry that's 
left over from that. I got these little wooden wooden um, hoops or whatever you call them, rings. I thought those were really cute. So I got those because I got them for um, I had got a couple of neck necklaces a while back that I got from Timu and they're wood like this. They're real pretty. I wore one yesterday and this would have looked real good with what I had on but I ordered these to kind of match those necklaces is what I'm trying to say. Get my little cloud cutter. And here is a bracelet. Let me take my bracelet off so I can show you this. What in the world? It's got a tape. <clears throat> it's got like plastic around this thing. I'm trying to take the plastic off of it. I hope everybody's doing well. How's everybody been? What have y'all been doing? I just, I was going to do a haul yesterday, but me some things that we wanted to go do, and, and I never did get it back around to doing the haul. So this is a pearl bracelet that I got. It's pretty, isn't it? It's stretchy. It's a stretchy kind. They didn't sit. They didn't think that one out. I don't think. It's kind of tight. Okay, next. I hope the lighting is all right, guys. Here is just some silver, some little silver um, hoops. They're just little silver hoops. They're cute. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put them together. So all of my hoop earrings. That's how I do them. I put them together like that. I wish all of them would go together like that. had something underneath my nail. I was like, ew, what is that? Gross. That's real appealing. I don't even know what it was. It's like... Lotion or something. put lotion on my face this morning. I didn't get it all good and off of me. Okay, these earrings are so teeny tiny. Like, probably going to have a hard time keeping up with these things. I'm curious what they're going to look like on me. Look how little these are. I'm going to put one on. What, what do I have? Okay. It's raining today again. It's been raining here for two days. We're having to mow our yard once a week. We've had so much rain. Look at that. They don't look too bad, do they? It's really close up and personal, guys, isn't it? No, they don't look too bad. Like I said, 
it's going to be really hard to keep up with these things. I'm going to put them straight in my little jewelry box right here. I've ordered quite a bit of traveling stuff, like I told y'all earlier. I've ordered, um, I've ordered a container to keep my jewelry in and some makeup bags for all of us and stuff like that. I'll leave this earring off for a minute because I got several earrings here that I want to show y'all and it's nice whenever you put it in your ear and let people see what it looks like. I got these. They're like hearts and they just see how they do. And that's what they look like. What do y'all think about those? They're kind of cute. A little cute. Different, aren't they? Okay, this here. I think this might be a necklace. I'm not for sure. Yeah, it is. It's a, one of those balloon, balloon dogs. And this was really cheap, like 47 cents. So, I just got it. I thought the girls would wear it. I thought it was cute. It was so cheap, I had to buy it. It'll probably turn green in a day or two. See what else I got over here. I gotta open up all these bags. Oh, okay. This is a pair of silver earrings like I have on. Like these gold ones. It's just silver ones like that. These have a name for them, these earrings, but I don't know what the name is. Because they come in different sizes. They come in like small size like this, and then you can get them big or really big. So... They're like a knockoff for a designer, I but mean, I don't know who. If y'all know, let me know. This here is a necklace. I don't know why I'm always buying necklaces. I don't. I won't change my necklace. I think this was real cheap, really cheap. It's two little butterflies. What is that in the front? It's got... Oh, they got diamonds on them. One of them does. That's cute. I'm going to put that on Layla's dresser. I'll give that to Layla. And these pearl bracelets are going to go to Sadie. Sadie wants them. These pearl bracelets I said you're going to get them. That's what they look like. They were real cheap. But they're really pretty. I, like there's. Four of them. Four of them. But they're cute as can be. So. Those are going to go to save girl. <coughs> Here is a little bracelet. I'll have to give Layla this too because it, no, this is silver and that's gold. But here's a little bracelet. It's got two little um, butterflies on it. That's cute. Layla loves bracelets. She loves bracelets and rings and shoes. That child, everywhere I go, I buy that kid a pair of shoes. I bet you she has 50 pair of shoes. I got this ring and I really like it a whole lot. Isn't that pretty?
I knocked my finger. I don't know how I did it, but I knocked it somehow and got a purple mark. I hate that. It's so embarrassing. But that's what that looks like. I gotta go have my fingernails done. They have grown out. Like, that's my fingernails underneath. That's how long they are. And then all they do when I go in there, all they do is they file this stuff off. And then I dip my finger a whole bunch of times in this stuff. And these are my fingernails. And they all they do is just cap them and, you know, keep them. They don't, I don't go in there and they glue a nail on me or so on and so forth. They just do my nails. That was a non who cares story. Sorry, guys. And here is just a simple bracelet, but I thought it was really cute. Sadie might want this one, too. My wrists are so little. They just... That's what it looks like. You like this? No. You look so beautiful. Good. Yes, good. I wish y'all could see her. She's so pretty. Can you come say hi? Huh? Can you come say hi? You want me to pop my head in that camera? Yes. Maybe. Huh? Maybe. Ah, oh, she gave me a maybe. <laughs> you get lucky enough, maybe. Here's another little bracelet that I got. That's so cute. It's got the magnetic deal on there. Let me see if I can hook it up. Those are so easy. Ooh, that's pretty. I love it. I love that one. That is cute. Cute, cute. Here is another necklace. I love these necklaces. And this one is a pretty green color. Will it match my shirt? Does it match my shirt better? Y'all think? Or this one? This one, I think. But anyway, that's so pretty. I want to order a, a black color like this. They have it in black. I'm just wanting to order a black one. So, that's pretty. Next is my keychain. It's just a sparkly, shiny D. Just a keychain. I have about 100 keychains on my ring. I had to give some of them away. I need to get a drink, guys. I need to speed this up and quit talking. Here's some more teeny tiny earrings like the ones I showed you, the gold ones, but they're in silver. I'm not going to even open it because it's getting closer and closer to my time that I need to be somewhere. You were meant to be there. I know. About 20 minutes ago. So this is a real precept. It's got three, um, three pieces in it. It's got this solid chain and it's got this like chain link deal and then it has this real pretty pearl bracelet that you put this little deal in it like that I, I like these kind of bracelets and it goes like that that's pretty I like this set and put it with these gold ones. That'll look nice. I do not need to order no more jewelry. I'm so loaded down with jewelry, guys. It's not even funny. And, of course, I did. Oh, no. This is different. This is another little bracelet. It's just a bunch of little um, 
butterflies. That's so dainty. This would be really cute on. Are y'all bored yet? Okay, guys. This is a necklace. This is a necklace. It is like chains on that side and pearls on that side. And it hooks kind of like that bracelet. Can y'all even see it? How it hooks. I don't know. What do y'all think about wearing this necklace? It seems like it's not thick enough or something. Maybe you'd have to wear something else with it. Because that's how it looks. I don't know about that. Maybe if you had on a solid color like a black or something maybe it might be alright but I don't know it needs something I, I don't know about that one guys I just don't know if I like that alright next is some more pearls this is this is the order I was telling y'all that I got on the pearl kit and ordered all kinds of pearl stuff here's another necklace set that's like that again, except it's shorter. So, I might be giving this to Sadie as well. And then, here's this. This one is pretty. And it has that kind of deal on it. This matches the bracelet set, because look, that's the necklace. And here's the other part of necklace. It's just like the bracelets. So this actually goes with the bracelet set. I'll give all this to Sadie. Alright guys. I took off my earring because I thought I had tons of earrings to show y'all. And I haven't even gotten any more. But here is a pair of earrings. I got these because they're yellow. And I have some yellow stuff. And I thought they were really cute. What do y'all think about those? They're cute, aren't they? I hear it raining outside. Got those. Haven't got a chance to wear my real pretty purple shirt yet because it's been too warm here. But why I was talking about that is I ordered these earrings to go with it. And they're just really cute, simple, but they are purple. They're cute. I'm trying to fix them. Yeah, they're cute. Cute, cute, cute. My niece is calling me. She's helping. She's helping me look for a um, a good price on a, like a van. Um, no, Connie, not right now. On a van because we're going to have to rent a big van for all of us to drive to Florida because there are seven of us. And we want to be comfortable. We don't want to take two cars and we don't want to be cramped up. So, we're going to rent. This is really pretty. I like this a whole lot. This is my favorite out of all the pearls. And it winds around your wrist like that. It's dainty and it's cute. I like that. I have all these pearl stuff to give you. She likes pearls. She has on pearls today. Okay, guys, that's all of this. I'm going to try my shirts on real fast and then say goodbye. 
because I'm running out of time and I've got to be somewhere. So, I'm going to try to hurry. Hold on one sec. Okay, guys, I've got to do a hurry try on. And I know my head might be cut off a little bit, but I had to put the camera down a little bit lower so y'all could see what I've got on. Here is one of them that I got. This is really long. It's long enough that I can wear a pair of leggings underneath it and be really cute. A navy pair. But isn't it pretty? And these shirts, all the shirts that I'm trying on are, they either have <clears throat> like 65% cotton or 100% cotton. They all are cotton shirts. So here's this one. Here's the next one, this blue and white check. It almost hurts your eyes when you look at it. It has that design on it. You know what I mean? Like, sometimes you'll look at stripes and it'll be like, ugh, it kind of hurts your eyes. This shirt kind of does that. But it'd be really pretty with a nice long necklace that matches. And it goes down um, real long in the back, like past my butt. And it goes down long in the front, like all the way down to cover my fat stomach. So, this is this one. This is another one. This is like the shirt that I bought that everybody liked on me so well. It's kind of like a mustard color. And it has all these buttons down the front. Now, this shirt is 100% cotton and it feels so nice on. It's real just like airy kind of feeling. And it's, it's plenty long. So that's this one. Now this one is really pretty and summery looking. It has this like embroidery kind of look to it on the side. This one is um, cotton as well, I think. I don't have my glasses so I can't see. If it's not 100%, it's like... 65% or something and it feels like it feels like it's a hundred percent it's so nice and cool and just breezy be really cute with a pair of white shorts or or black shorts okay here's another really long one it's uh, pretty thin but I think it's alright it's not too see-through it has the buttons down the front and it's got like the pleats on it it's really comfortable. It's just really airy and it, I think it is, they're all extra larges. But I can't see, can't see what it is guys. Let me put on my glasses. No, now this one is 68%. It's V-I-S. C-O-S-E, I don't know how to pronounce that. And 32% polyester. But it feels like cotton. So whatever that material is, it's similar to cotton. This is really long. See, it's all the way long. I can't even... One thing about me having my camera that way is you can't see the bottom part. So it's really long. You could wear leggings underneath this if you wanted to, but I would just wear it with blue jeans. Okay, now this one is a little bit tight on me, and it's an XXL, but it's an Asian, um, an Asian size, so they run smaller, and it's kind of short, and pull the britches up, it's kind of short, it, that's my belt right there, so you can kind of tell how short the top of it is, but you could always kind of tuck it in if you wanted to, but leaving it out, it's alright. It's a little tight up through here. So, and it's longer in the back than it is in the front. So, that's what this one looks like. Okay, this one's really pretty. I like this a whole lot. It's just simple and it's real just flyaway. It looks like something you would wear in Florida. <laughs> so it's it's really long you could even wear leggings with this it's long in the back and it's just a simple shirt and you just put on a real pretty necklace like say the one that I just got ha 
untied my bra strap. And that would look so nice. Yes, I like it a lot. It would be real cute. I have a pair of um, white pants, but they're like boho kind of pants. Like big bells at the bottom. They would look really cute with just a plain pair of sandals and those white boho pants. Matter of fact, I ordered some boho pants from Timu that I haven't gotten in yet. And I really hope that they fit me. Just some flyaway, easy pants, you know. So, those are to come. Okay, this is a green one. These are all those Asian shirts. The ones with all these buttons down the front. This is made just like the other two, but it's in this pattern. I don't care so much for these yellow buttons. I don't know why they did that, but I don't know. I could change the buttons out, but guys, that's a lot of buttons. So, I don't know. But anyway, it's cute. It's very comfortable, and it feels like you have nothing on. And I love them. I love these. Now, I have three of these, so I have all the colors. But, yeah. So, guys, that is my haul for today. Um, Sadie is waiting on me patiently in the living room because we need to go. And I love and I appreciate y'all. And um, this is my Timu haul for today. Um, anybody that hasn't um, downloaded the Timu app or checked Timu out, y'all go and do that. It's a really cool company. Um, this is not a uh, sponsored video, so I'm just saying. I love Timu. But, anywho, I love and I appreciate y'all. And, Angela, I have been drinking my water. So, thank you for talking about me and mentioning my name and joining me on my diet. Um, me and you could be besties. <laughs> so, I love and appreciate y'all guys. And, um, I will see you, I hope, tomorrow. So, I love y'all.